Hello guys, I hope you are all doing fine. So today we are with another Summoner's War Low Century episode. And you know, we need to collect our prizes first. All these goodies that we can find. So here we go guys. Starting off strong with another cool monster Orion. That's more like it. Starting off with something new. A fun monster to play with. Let's see the shop. Nice, I can get an Orion piece from here as well. To level up Orion, obviously. There we go, three Orion cards at the moment. Looking nice though. Armful prank. Okay. So, guys, I've collected all the events. Now, let's check if I can craft some runes. For to make our monsters a little bit stronger giving them an additional boost to their stats okay only one rare rune the green one is the rare rune let's check our monsters as you know we got ran let's just collect the prize first reward first and then let's see what runes uh, as you can see in the top bottom corner sorry not the top bottom but the bottom left corner so as you can see the arrow is showing you that it is a orion is a support monster and support monster usually needs energy or energy or guard runes guard runes are for defense and energy runes grant you with 15 percent more health so use these runes and and if you want the player the monster in your team to get a turn before the other team then you should use swift runes swift runes had have, have the advantage that it it gives you one minus one times turn for example if your attack attack is ready in three turns if you equip your monster with swift runes you will get it in two turns minus one so that was a type of explanation Orion level up leveled up this is Hamoon is my main attacking monster at the moment that I'm playing with and he is on level 6 I'm using Doomsday as well now because I, I think Doomsday can be helpful as well so but I don't have the necessary runes to use it on Doomsday and as you can see let's try enchantments if what's so this is so this is a new rune system let's try to power up and see what happens uh, i guess nothing happened wasted a rune let's try to power this up okay let's use all of them or maybe just one uh, let's use this one okay so so the defense increased from 1% to 1.2% that way you can give additional stats to your monsters that could really help you in battle and currently I need I'm changing the team and let's check if someone has accepted my alliance request because I am not getting into any alliance guys I think I am cursed okay so th that's the best I can do but there are only two players uh, should I stay or should I leave because two players I cannot get much of a benefit from this alliance I need an alliance where, where there are more players that I can learn from and that can benefit me in game as well so oh shit there was a timer I can join the alliance in 30 minutes now so I have to wait 30 minutes moving on guys I have unlocked level 1 as I as you have seen in the previous video let's try and see what this level land holds for us so an npc comes 
her name is ellen okay i guess these are the stages what is this uh, let's just battle guys and see what the results came come so this is my first scenario battle and i really am hoping for good graphics i mean the scenario graphics okay looks nice so first orion let's check what orion does obviously orion stuns he stunned one monster and wow that's nice cool damage by the way so let's counter it with my hellhound oh a little less to kill roid let's use our colleen as well to increase health and attack what should we uh, let's use murf to change the location let's go ryan now ryan is an mvp as you can see the stuns that this guy's guy can do if if he can land four stuns then basically the team is the team can't do much limited options for the team so let's oh uh, okay ramagos is about to die and he's dead my colleen couldn't save him i tried my best ramagos you should know that there we go the first level was easy guys first stage of the first level i guess it was easy let's see what the second stage holds guys please like subscribe and comment and let me know what i should do next i will try to do the best i can for you guys and this journey is just started so let's make some cool videos and build a community so this is the second battle guys i leveled up some of my monsters as you saw from the from the cards that i got from the treasure chest that i got from level 1 oh so this is stage 2 as you know this monster ryan is very 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 useful see he stunned he randomly he randomly stuns monsters so stunning someone means they cannot attack you for a certain period of period of time and that could help you a lot imagine if there is only two monsters left then orion will target only those two monsters so the less the the lesser the more accurate the more monsters you have the more random orion gets oh my god that was a nice attack by the opponent my ramagos was about was stunned but morph saves the day there you go let's go colleen heal me up there comes the continuous damage so this continuous damage basically decreases your max hp by 5% so one continuous damage decreases your hp by 5% two if there are two then 10% and it keeps on adding so it's quite useful to kill enemies with continuous damage as well see orion just attacks four times and there is and he can stun four times as well so there you go so i cleared the second wave as well the second wave was also not that much hard i got three stars in the first try so i am hoping to open the treasure chest as well to see what's in store for me and come on give me a good monster come on come on come on Just regular parts. Oh, I got a Colleen upgrade though. So that's nice. Mm, let's battle again. This game is part experimenting and part learning from other players and trying what works for them and what works for you and combining both of these to make a unique set of skills 
for your team so there goes orion with its with his random oh he didn't get a stun this time but there goes sofia with the kill and colleen with the heal <coughs> usually i ignore the front line attackers front, front line defenders because i i want to kill the enemy fast so that's why i try to focus on the back line and do as many attacks as i can before my forward line dies that's my strategy that's a beginner strategy i guess okay so there was another attack so this guy this guy also stuns so the more you stun the more the enemy can't attack you okay colleen come on you are a lifesaver come on Murph. Murph. nice changes sides there goes come on with the kill and there comes the continuous damage slowly training our energies with continuous damage Marv about to die and I guess Marv will die yep my guess was right so it's three versus seven it's a comfortable win three versus six stuns the more you stun the more chances you have to kill the enemy fast before them attacking you okay come on kill him okay so the third stage is also cleared guys three starts again in the first try i hope we get something good this time from the treasure 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 chest chapter one has been unlocked it was already unlocked i guess i have unlocked the boss now still normal cards got some level ups okay so i should collect the cards oh shit <laughs> i am just getting power ups but that's a good thing as well the more power ups you get the more powerful your strong your monsters get the more stronger you get so there we go we got a mav power up he goes from level 4 to level 5 then we have a hellhound a colleen level up Colleen reached level 4 I guess the maximum level that at the moment is 15 but maybe they would increase the level cap in the coming days it's just the start of the game so I guess the game can change the game will change a lot of things in the coming months and years because I I know with summoners were their first game they have changed a lot since the beginning and with this game they will be aiming to hear what other users have to say what the players have to say what the community has to say that's why the previous first game was successful and they will try to replicate the same for this game as well obviously they are not new to this industry so they they know how to build a good community around a game so i leveled up this skill as well and there we go guys level 3 finally finally i'm not a noob now i know how this game works at least okay level 3 giant warrior i wonder if i can use the giant warrior on lu shang and then one shot everyone i can use the attack buff that megan has she gives attack buff then i will use giant warrior and then i if i lucian maybe i can kill all of them at once but that's just my my thinking i will need to have some good runes on lucian as well so that's also a factor so here we go guys the boss battle is 
starting and uh, there goes the continuous damages come on i need some i need some power let's go let's go ramagos kill him that's more i like it that's why i like ramagos the less energy he has the more attack she the more attack he can do and the more hp recovery he can do so he has he's a good monster for starters for holding the line but he will die i tried saving him with mav but i was too late let's go colin this is the attack buff come on come on come on i got stunned oh my alarm just rang sorry for that guys let's kill him there goes the ramagos and yes okay okay orion let's do this let's show you show me your power not so much let's go hellhound kill okay so far so good guys going forward with a steady pace i guess i can do this in one shot as well one try as well this grim reaper is a little difficult to kill because he stuns a lot of my players so my aim okay so my grim reaper takes revenge he stuns everyone except the person who i wanted to stun who i wanted to stun so i guess guys we got the win in the bag because his team is totally annihilated and my whole team is alive at the moment except for ramagos so three stars again as usual we have beaten the first boss of the game guys so that's it guys for today's episode and do like comment and subscribe on my channel and share my videos stay safe with your family and till next time guys thank you so much